Hey everybody, it's Corey and Ray. Winding away with Corey and Ray and we are so happy to have you back. And we're here to talk about wine and who knows whatever else we're going to talk about today. You never know. I mean, as as we speak, it's the middle of March. How, how many shows have we done so far this year? Is this only our second? Yes, okay. we did in January and so we'll be... So we're back. This is our spring edition. Mm -hmm. Spring a ding ding. Yep, but we hope you're having nice weather wherever you are and uh, getting ready for longer days and shorter nights and better weather. So Ray, butterflies, butterflies and flowers. Ray brought um, a bottle of wine for us today. Tell him, Ray. So you want me to talk about the bottle of wine? Yeah, let's let's try that. What the? Could have said some. Uh, so one of the fun things I get to do with my job is build sections from certain areas. So uh, after the new year, you know, you go through, recover from the holidays, try to see what what needs bulking up, what maybe needs to be thinned out a little. But my Chilean section needed some love. So I put out an APB to all my reps and said, let me see what you've got from Chile. Chile needs help. I need some help in Chile. Chile today, hot tamale. <laughs> yeah. So one of the wines that I decided to bring in was this Cabernet. Now Chile makes great cabs. They make great blends. Um, you could really a lot of different varietals from Chile. They wow. make Merlot, they make Pinot Noir, Sauvignon Blanc, Chard. Top 100 from James Suckling. James, nothing ever sucks Suckling. And 93 points from somebody. Somebody. Also, James Suckling. So James obviously did it twice mm -hmm. with someone's name whom we don't know. Um, but, like I said, uh, Chile is really known for cabs, and, you know, they do really good blends. Uh, Carmenere being one of the grapes that's kind of indicative of Chile. They put those in a lot of blends, and they make straight Carmenere. But I'm a big fan of their cabs. They're more French in style than, say, California. They're not super fruity. You know, they're subtle. They're nuanced. Um, this one is kept in French oak, so it's very tight. doesn't give off a huge oak presence. Did we, we didn't get mom in here. No. She'll have some on the last show. What the? I, I mean. She doesn't want any. No, no, no. But everyone always says they love to hear off camera whether Nance likes it. She doesn't have any. She can try mine when we're done because I can't drink it. But we're not recording, so that's a big deal. I'll slide it What's over Mimi to What's Mimi Ryan going to do if mom doesn't comment on wine? Well, we're just happy that people like Mimi. Hi, Mimi. Keep coming back. You're saying people like Mimi, but it sounded like you were like, we're so happy people like Mimi. Oh, like, like, no. Like that she people just has like friends. Mimi return to our show and watch it more than once. Like, we're happy for those people. Um, but, you know, we don't know that you're there unless we run into you and you happen to say, oh, my God, I loved your episode on this or I really watched this or why don't you give me more of this? We don't know. And we don't run into all of you all of the time. That's what social media is for. So be social. if you look on there, there is a comment section. While you're watching this video, comment section. Even on YouTube, there's a comment section. Tell us what you think. Tell us what you want to see more of. Ask us a question. Tell us off. Tell us whatever you want. But we would just like to hear from you. Check like. If you watch the show and you don't feel like making a comment because that's just too much for you. You can hover over the little thumb, just hit it, and then we know you're there, and it helps get us more traction through Facebook and Instagram because you liked it. So we would really appreciate you taking that millisecond and clicking the button. Thank you. So there you go. <laughs> Be like Mimi and hit like. Um, she doesn't hit like, but... Well, she's gonna now. She is. Um, so this is, uh, we didn't say the name yet, the Ravenel Grand Reserve. 
And uh, it's kept 12 months in French and American oak, it says. Um, but it's got, you know, nice uh, nice balance to it. Pass that to Mom. Take they it. talk about a little bit of tobacco. I didn't really pick up the I, tobacco. I, you know, and on the scent, I On the I nose, got, perhaps. Yes, on the uh, nose, I got a little bit of... But on the... In the glass, I really get a lot of, like, mulberry. Like, it's got that, like, touch of earthy. Well, Mom felt it was a little too earthy. <laughs> She's keeling over in the corner from a half a sip. Boy, we should really put pitcher in pitcher because you missed you quite a so shot. <laughs> it didn't even enter your bloodstream yet. It's just going to my throat. <laughs> It burned her throat, so if you're looking for a nice burn, maybe this is for nice you. Nice throat burn, rather now. Um, How much? Eleven ninety nine, I think. Like it's not expensive, um, but we've talked about that from Chile before. Like you could really, you know, under fifteen bucks get something really, really nice. So this is the newest Chilean cab that I brought in, and uh, so far so good. Everyone I've given it to is very happy with it. Yeah, I mean, make this the year of adventure. Make this year where you try things you don't normally try. If you like red wine, especially if you like cabs, don't stick with the California and the... Go see Ray. Ask for a Chilean cab. He's got a lot. His section is now expanded and renewed and refreshed. And God knows what you'll find. And you may love it. You may absolutely love it. And you could say... 2024 was the year where I expanded my mind and opened my palate and just took off. Thanks to Corey and Ray and their pep talk. We'd like, we'd like to hear that people find us Boy, are we going to get comments now? Inspirational. No, you think we would. On some of the shows, some of the things we've said and done, we still don't get comments. I, I don't understand, but... Uh, People are watching. We know that. so Nobody wants to be involved in any of the <laughs> algorithms that go on. They don't want to be involved in this mess. Oh, like just you. watch the train wreck from afar. We understand. I like you. Next thing you know, people want me to like other things. <laughs> and, and this is just too much work. Yeah, it's a whole like fest. So I'd rather just keep scrolling and not really. We have two choices, people. You can do the same old crap. Or you could take our 2024 challenge. Do something different. Go for a walk. Ride a bike. Pet a dog. Click like on Facebook. Click like on something you've watched and said you've liked. Tell people how you feel. Especially if it's nice. If it's good, give people compliments. They let's, like them. Let's spread compliments this year. Huh? Spread love and kindness. Huh? That's what we're going to do. Huh? <laughs> you You start. <laughs> That's a fetching blouse. You see? Was that painful? No. <laughs> okay. And I love the way you wear your glasses on your head. <laughs> They're not on your face. Helps me see my thoughts clearly. <laughs> Does it though? <laughs> I hope so. <laughs> Keeps me from letting certain things out. <laughs> Lucky you. So thank you again. For tuning in if you want this particular bottle reach out ray can help you get it or just go try a chilean cabernet and um who knows maybe it's your new favorite wine so we thank you for joining us and we'll be back again soon um subscribe to our youtube channel whining away with Corey and ray tv and we'll see you again but until next time cheers to good life cheers to good friends and cheers, cheers to, to great wine 2024, I do it differently.